Hello everyone. Here's a quick video on how to install and set up the unstable PlayStation Core on your Mr. FPGA. The Core hasn't been officially released yet, but there are pre-release unstable builds available for you to try out. I've been asked about how to install these unstable builds several times, and some instructions I made a while back no longer work. So I decided to create this updated video. Now let's get started. In order for the PlayStation Core to work, you need to have a specific PlayStation BIOS. The BIOS name is SCPH1001.BIN. This BIOS file is copyrighted, so I cannot provide it for you, but I'm sure you can find an archive out there that has it available. You also will want some PlayStation games in either ISO or bin slash Q format. Once you have the BIOS and games, have them all ready to copy to your DE10 NATO. The next step is to download the current unstable nightly. These are provided by the Ypsilon. To get the nightlies, check for the GitHub link in the description. On the GitHub link, scroll down to the bottom to get to the latest version. Click on it and save it to a folder on your computer. Okay, so now you should have the PlayStation BIOS and the latest unstable nightly PlayStation Core. The next step is to create a folder on your SD cards games directory. My full path is forward slash media forward slash fat forward slash games. I've seen some setups have different locations, but just use the folder where all your games are stored. In the folder, create a directory called PSX. Make sure you use all capitals. Now go into that directory and copy the BIOS file onto the PSX folder and also copy your games. I keep each game in its own folder because some of them may have multiple files. Now we need to rename the BIOS file. Rename it to boot.rom. Make sure it's all lowercase. The next step is to copy the core to your SD card. The folder that you want to copy it to is the underscore console folder. Once that's done, you're ready to play some games. So let's turn on the DE10 Nano. Go to console, scroll down until you find PSX Unstable, and run it. You will see the PlayStation boot up sequence, and then it will go into its internal menu. To load a game, bring up the Mr. menu, select Load CD, and select any games you copy to your DE10 Nano. Remember to define your gamepad buttons, or else you won't be able to control anything in the game. And we're done. Please remember that this is an unstable build, and you will experience issues, so only use this for testing. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like. And if you want to see more content like this, hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon so you can get notified of future videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll speak to you next time.